And welcome everyone back to We Happy Few. Now we're left off. Of course. You need to rob houses while people are inside asleep. You mean... Yeah. I guess it makes things much more easier when they are asleep in one place and I could just kill them. Yes. Alright. Now I don't really know much as well too, but uh, maybe some of the areas have been more copy and paste. I don't know. Areas being copy and paste the game. Yeah, you know what? That could be that could be bad. That could be maybe a temporary thing, you never know. Even some areas do look like, like the same, but who knows? Maybe that thing can get like, a change over time, but not. I don't know. <laughs> It's like the joy just broke something in her mind. What was it, bad joy? Seems like there's been a lot of bad joy lately. I wonder if that's why there are so many downers these days. Or did I just never notice? Maybe. Maybe there is so many downers. But yeah. So yeah, we left off. I mean, actually, uh, Puri had to put a protest, protest leader out of his misery because, hey, he, uh, you know, wasn't, wasn't doing too good, and so... That needed to be done. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. <laughs> indeed, we do, indeed. Oh, my heavens, they're dead! So you're, so are you. Right then. You're coming with me. Right. What's the problem? No more, Mr. Knight. Give up. And I won't smash your face. I swear to God. That's the last time you do that around here. <laughs> Had it been for that idea of the screaming ladies, I would have, uh, you know, get through. Look at him! He's gone! I know it was you! There! The one with the blood on his hand! Did it? Why are they someone just trying to decide to gang up on me all of a sudden? Right then. I swear to Christ. Say goodnight! What the hell? I think I'm actually sick. Oh, that's why. There you go, let him come in. It'll be a fun time now. That's the last time you do that around here! Alright, now the coppers, which are gonna be down. That dog! Bad dog, me? Down oh. Oh. I swear to Christ! I'll fix you! No, I'll fix you. Down off! Down off! Black dog! <laughs> oh, <laughs> Sorry. Ah, uh, what can I some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. Hmm, I just wanna kill, you know. Kill, kill, kill! <laughs> Alright. Duct tape. Get rid of these ones. I don't even really need them right now. What else? I... Oh yeah, that's right. Hmm. What else do I need compared to what I don't need? Hmm. This I don't need. Ew. Yucky. All right. This I don't want. This I don't want. No. Carrot. Nope. Hmm. 
Nah. Nope. Nope. Nah. Good. What else we're missing? After killing so many people, please kill. I'll kill some more. Ooh. Well, not bad. <laughs> not bad. Wraps your entire body in rubber. Reduces it up to shock. Alarms anyone who is not a rubber fetishist. Alright. Just the branch and then I'll be all good. <laughs> now I know what, what I should... What, whoa. Tranquilized dart. And a vomit bomb. A rotten apple. Oh! Even rotting meat as well too. I'll find something, use, something useful with these damn darn things. Bloody hell. Block party. Tank. Hmm. It's five. That's true, it's perfect. And of course, they gave me some goodies. I suppose scotch. There we go. What I use the best, eh? What I use the best. I can't believe I went through all of that just to cross a bridge and go see Sally. Well, Arthur, maybe you shouldn't have been such an ass. Maybe you should have said, Oh, yes, Sally, do talk to your friend the general for me. What a kind thing to offer. Well, Indeed. I for all my mistakes <laughs> and let everyone else run free. There we go. Man, if there was gore, if there was ever gore in this game, I would love to behead him. Look at that, he's deceived. Hmm. You know what, guys? Maybe he's a little tired. I just think he needs a bit of, um... Where'd he go? I just wanted to toss him off the, uh, off the wall, off the ledge here and see what that'll do. Eh, never mind. Not at least for now, I'd say. Lovely day for it. Righto. I always love, you know, to cheer up my victims before I get to kill them. I don't funny how the loot doesn't respawn. That could be a quite a bit of a problem, I think. Put the damn thing away. When I press a button, you dope. I just borrow this. Hold on. Just so I can get myself some more. Where am I? Joy booth. Yes, yes. Good. All right. I'm gonna go this way. Well, this one here is quite a bit of a dangerous one, I'd say. But you know what? Boilers too. I think the fog has actually gotten worse. Oh, indeed. I just want to fix the damn thing if I know where to, where to find it. And again, did they even let me? Probably not. Lovely day for it. Do you remember when we used to swim in the river? I don't. Me neither. Why would I? Why would I? The fog seems... smokier. I wanna fix the damn thing, you know? That's what I wanna do. Unless I have some, some explosive thing over here. 
A grenade banger, rubber duck. You know what? Screw it. Hold on. No, it's the other side. Molotov spill. Maybe inside that building over there, right? Apparently it is. Give my localization. But it's not saying much. Oh who knows, maybe something fixed? Or something that was fixed, I don't know. Or maybe something nearby. Oh, oh yes, oh yes. At least you can put down there. Figured I might have was, you know, just go on, no on foot. For a few reasons. Lovely weather. There you are. Right oh! Are you new around here? Or did I just forget? It happens, you know. Oh, indeed, it happens. I want to see if there's more things I forgot, you know? You already did loot everything here. That's odd. Victim! What am I doing? His honey bun is no more. Same thing under the bed, you know? Oh my friends, night will be falling soon. And you don't want to be out at night, do you? Time to go home and get all tucked up in bed. Oh, I agree with that. That's just lovely. Don't you think? Hmm? Yeah. Right. <sighs> oh, your move, Sam. Man. Wakey, wakey, everyone. <laughs> Good morning to you. Good morning to you. Good morning, dear friends. Good morning to you. <laughs> I do hope you had a lovely night's sleep. And let all the troubles of the day in dreamland. That is, if you have any troubles, 
Remember what was bothering you yesterday? <laughs> I certainly hope not. But today is going to be even better. Now mm -hmm. we all forget things from time to time. Oh yes, yeah, don't forget the most that. important thing. Did you leave the stove on? Did you remember oh. to shave? Hmm. Did you wash your hands? Did you brush your teeth? I hope Maybe you did, did all these things, but they're not the most important thing. And that is, as we all know, did you take your joy today? Oh, of course. You Gotta take my joy to today. Take your joy, and I guarantee you will be able to go as smooth as though. Oh, yes, I just took my joy. Thank you for reminding me, Uncle Jack. So, thank you very much. Let's take a look at today's schedule. What's going on in the village of Hanlin? Well, selling and buying, of course, and wandering hither and thither, mm. and marketing and talking about the weather, and smiling and laughing, oh, of course. Oh, 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 yes. I insist on it. <laughs> but at three, I hope you'll all take a quick break for our daily recreation activity. Today we'll, once again, all gather around the telly for a rousing round of Simon's... No, nope, thank you very much. So, I wish I could. Should clear up soon, I imagine. Did you hear? The circus is coming to town. Oh, that's just lovely. Joy immediately. I can't keep doing this. Couldn't no. be better, thanks. Those are the nuts. Ah ha 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 ha! Those nuts. Ha ha ha! Yeah, very nuts. Ha 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 ha! The nuts. Ha ha ha! So funny, so hilarious. The nuts. Thank you for the tea, you dopes. Maybe I am. Who is that for? Not me, I hope. You can't just wave a weapon about. It's not a toy. Stop! In the name of the law! That's the one who done it! That's them pissing me You're gonna lynch mob after me now. Look at them! They've got blood on their hands! They've got blood all over There we go. Now I'm ready. Must have gave up suddenly. Right here. did heal a bit more that'd be amazing but does it it simply doesn't that's a bit of a problem but that's not gonna bother it now is I it hope I can convince the nice bobbies to let me fix their bridge Oh, I hate you so much. Simon says, step on one lit platform. Ah, fine. Lovely day for it. Wait, did he get it? Well, I could take these all the time, but I wouldn't have any worries. Right. Joy, Happiness is a choice. Yeah, they're all being affected by it now. Simon says, step on two platforms. It's perfectly getting away. That's one. That's two. Fantastic! Did you get it? Here's some joy. You can never have too much joy, can you? Happiness no, is not. a choice. 
I'm really tempted. <laughs> I didn't say Simon says. Now, Simon says, step on three lit platforms. <laughs> George's home. Free has come back at night. Are you all right? You seem a bit sick. No, I'm just doing the best I'll ever be. Indeed it does. We'll laugh about this later. When they made you, they broke the mold. You're sick and you need help. To know you as well, too, friend. Lovely day. They don't make them like you anymore. Good business here. Good lord, we've got a donut. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Ow. Could you not? Oh, I hate that son of a bitch who throws shit at me. Doing this to each other. Not a joy pill, at least. Mushroom. So I want to get that little small team. We all appreciate what you do. Yes. Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. Anything else rotten? 
course there is. Yeah, of course there is. What is I don't need? Hmm? You don't actually have, like so much or two. You don't belong in this world. Uh, can't we just agree to disagree? <laughs> Come to the moment where I find me Molotovs and whatnot. I find a refuge in the, mo uh, the Molotovs, and why the fuck does smoke going in here? Doesn't matter. Okay, that's still awkward, but alright. Get up! <laughs> I've always liked you, actually. Yo, you bring the best out in me. Annoy me to that annoy me so much to the point I I simply seek to kill everyone new. I'm even looking for him. Ah, of course. I feel like this read this place a little too important, you know. Just to be some random encounter here. Don't you think? Hmm? Mind you think so myself. Bleach. Another one right around somewhere, but all in due time, yes. All in due time. I can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. Indeed. Indeed. Hmm. 
chemistry lab upgrade. All right, I don't mind. Diary of Wanda. Hmm, hold on. Chemical reaction, Dr. Verloc. He's not an expert in imagination. This too. Oh god, imagination. More joy. I prefer to remember more joy. Interesting. And yet I've got nothing out of reading those. No, you may not use my loo. Bloody mule! Pick what you can carry easily! Knew, knew it wouldn't work. I just knew it wouldn't. But hey, worth a shot, yes? <laughs> Unfortunate part is, I mean, I... If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Mm, yeah, true. Whoever lived here, I mean, was very, very into, well, medicine, I guess. That's why! Nothing but blue skies! Alright. Down a breach. Don't turn around, don't turn around. Just that? Oh, news hour. What do you do if you're with a downer? Hmm. Well, if it's you, then just excuse yourself and take your joy right away. You'll be as right as Reagan in no time. Oh, yes, indeed. But what if it's not you? Well, the first thing to do is ask the downer, have you had enough joy today? Most sensible people will realize they've forgotten their morning joy. After all, forgetfulness can happen to any of us. In fact, it's a sign you're taking your joy. So, remind them and they'll take their joy right away and, yes, problem solved. But, what if the person won't take his joy? Well then, you need to step up and do your patriotic duty to your fellow citizen of Wellington Wells. If you can see a policeman or a doctor, simply notify them that there's a downer in the area and, yes, they'll take care of the rest. After all, it's their job. But, if there are no authorities, you may need to take action yourself. <laughs> Call your fellow citizens and let them know they've got a downer in their midst. They'll help you chase. Yeah, and we actually know this one already. And make sure he takes. It. Once he's recovered his senses, well, you can let him. If for any reason he fails to recover, sad feelings are contagious, and one bad apple spoils the whole. Wayward girls. At least. Oh, 
you're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. Jerky. It'll take a sec, I know. Three, two, one, boom. Perfect. Good. Very, very good. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. a little bit hungry. Slowly. House. How about over here? Yes. Couldn't be better, thanks. Well, hello, dearie. Hello, little granny. something away before something starts chasing you. Oh, that's worse than cat. <laughs> so many of these things. I have nothing to do with these bottles, nothing to do about them. So what can I do about it? Smirk bomb. What else am I missing that I don't really need? I definitely need. Repair? Oh yes. Hey. <laughs> Look! They got blood. Have more. Ah. Save a bit for the next minute.
Alright. At least you got a healing bomb, which is the good stuff. <laughs> Sewing kit. That's one thing I definitely need. A cup of tea is always more than good. If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. I suppose. I suppose. I think these uh, extra bars here are unnecessary weight, don't you think? We are right off here to rid of a few. Are you bringing me down? There you go, see? Excuse me, Excuse me little shit. That's right, didn't think so. for knocking down my blocks in kindergarten. shit at people. That's a good idea. Oh, amazing. That worked well. In that case... Hmm? You gotta drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. I could, but no. Right. Could you not miss? That'd be amazing. For fuck's sake! The duck's everywhere now. Healing bomb. Yes, please. There you go, see? Now they're both sitting down enjoying a nice music radio. Probably nothing going on bad now, right? Break the television, but hey, we should break the lamp as well too. We could break the fucking window. We should break everything. Yeah, maybe. Oh come on, you pack rat! You can't 
take a list with you. I guess you know uh, I'm a little hungry. Do you know I can cook? I'm just gonna cook, gonna cook a human. <laughs> For fuck's sake, get up over there, you lousy cunt. But still, though... I'm good, honey, to cheer up, don't you think? Nope, that didn't do anything. Essentially anywhere and everywhere. Ah, there we go. There. Yeah, if I knew how we were to turn the fire, we could, we could cook a human. Maybe. Yes, yes. Oh, rather than just doing this repeatedly, could just put a uh, put a marker down, and that'd be it. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. Isn't that Colonel Lawrence's house? He was the hero of Ramsgate, wasn't he? Did you change the door codes? No! Never mind! You probably don't know how! Are you guessing him his porridge? No! I'm turning the alarm system back on which someone left off! You want Sam Downer to walk in and take all our reserves? Why don't you tell the whole bloody neighbourhood we've got reserves? Oh yes, you must tell me about your wonderful reserves. Well? Mind me, I'm just a, a humble friend. I'm so buried in deep, now I'm not ever gonna know down here. No, never mind. Don't get shirty with me. Shirty? Shit! Just lie down! I think I see the Over there! No one to believe you. I'll just uh Does he? I haven't, haven't realized that. Oh, wrong with all this stuff. 
better throw something away before something starts chasing you. That's not it, you dope. Whatever. Hmm. Oh no! If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. How convenient. Oh, you're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. <sighs> Fucker. Knew it. Who's that? You're not Regina, and you're not my son-in-law. And he isn't the stones to have me drowned in a cask of Momsey. <laughs> so you're a burglar? Uh, I'm from this city. We're, uh, tracking a problem in the motoline pipes. You're a rotten liar. <laughs> the city stopped taking care of the pipes years ago. I noticed you're not screaming for help, though, sir. Have you met my daughter? <laughs> Frankly, I'd rather give my stuff to a burglar. <laughs> I don't tell you how rotten they can turn out. I trained grown men to make their beds. And run into machine guns. Kids will break your heart every goddamn day. Thanks for the warning, sir. Does your father know what sort of lad you are? I'm afraid he may have suspected, sir. So you've got regrets. <laughs> Good. Kids downstairs, any time they start to regret, they pop a joy. Look, take whatever you want. But my brother Edward, haven't seen much of each other these past few years. I'd appreciate it if you'd go tell him I'm... I'm sorry. He'll know what it means. He's on Monmouth Road, number 22. Huh. It used to be the most wonderful cheese shop on the corner. I'll be sure to pass along the message, sir. Well, clean it again. How I wish. Where did you go? Fresh socks. That's his answer to everything. What do you want? Bloody fresh socks. Stop being so bloody selfish! Mm. Uh. Oh. Uh. The killer's right there! Right? What have we come to? Maybe this is the perpetrator. See if I don't. That's them! Look, I don't even want to be here. Right. My eyesight is. Your help. Oh. Well, 
the fuck just like happened? Take so your joy immediately. Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. Mm hmm. Fuck. Oh, it doesn't kill you. Hello? Hello? Captain Lawrence? I've got a message for you, sir. Captain Lawrence, sir? Right. That's not a good sign. Oh. Blimey. A dog. They were fighting over a dog. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Hey, put that back! You thought you brought him in. Dog brought him in. God damn it. Fuck this. Where did she even come from, Elisa? Do we really have to do this? Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. All these things are just basically borderline useless. Oh, you're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. No, oh, a mule. Not yet, at least. Not yet. Oh. I definitely do need some of these things, I'd say. You can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. Sunshine. Why are I mean why isn't sunshine red? Son of a really hag. Slow going. Some of these things I just can't really bother to let go so much. Salt pepper. Got eleven of these ones. Hold on. Oh, that's why. I 
don't feel well at all. Bullshit. All right. Got two shovels. There. In that case, you won't get away with this. You son of a hag. Now watch them all just run about here. Got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They all gotta upgrade at least a tent. Hmm. I don't even remember leaving that one over there. In that case, excuse me, little lady. Oh. She almost <laughs> bathed her in vomit. Uh, excuse me, how do you do? I do pretty good. Oh. <laughs> I was all over her. I was all over her. Should I feel bad? No, I shouldn't. Mmm, yucky. I swear I'm gonna crush your head in. Pace yourself, Arthur. Should clear up soon, I imagine. Did you hear? They've caught Foggy Jack. Isn't that a relief? Oh, indeed it is, indeed. Oh dear. Oh. There, now another smoke emitter. Did I get in again? Guard duty again. Oh, yeah. Hey, actually, I don't really care. Uh, it's not personal. If I had been smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. This thing is fucked. This is fucked. What? Deceased. Dear friends, 
It's getting late. I hope you're all heading home and ready to go to bed. Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. Hey, whatever. Not gonna bother too much with that. Dear friends, it's getting late. I hope you're all heading home and ready to go to bed. That's this way, but I've got once. A lovely mm. bedtime. Your brother. I'm afraid I'll, I've been to his house. So I was too late. How? Uh, an accident. With a bookcase. Ah, oh, shit. Shit. What's the use? I meant to talk to him sooner. I wrote him so many letters. Maybe I should have sent them. No, oh, sir. Thank you, sir. I, uh, I don't suppose you found a footlocker there? A footlocker? No. I left a footlocker in his house. I'd rather you have it. That's very kind of you. Uh, where is it? Regret. It's what makes us human, son. Don't forget that. No, sir. Thank you, sir. He died. Lee Enfield rifle. Don't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. Well, I think this might fit actually. I'd need the trousers. Wait, what? What trout? Oh, shit. Right. Got the boilers to you, dope. Right. All right then. Hmm. Am I? Ah. <sighs> Why is it so goddamn heavy? Oh. Right. Seventy five. Maybe a bit more heavy than that. I see. What is it that I need compared to what I don't need? Why am I wearing a freaking boiler suit? Am I stupid? Ah. Hello. Welcome to today's edition of Humor Hour. The show where you tell me jokes. Well, actually, I tell the jokes, but you send them in. And the first joke comes from Mr. Prentice Gibson of Claverton Town. Gibson says, <laughs> what do you call, <laughs> what do you call three diamonds at the bottom of the sea? Oh. 
Not enough downers. <laughs> I don't really think it, but it's this dark sense of humor. I don't like that. We're starting off very strong today, aren't we? <laughs> this is one is from Bryony Dickin of Collier's Lane. <laughs> What's the difference between a downer and a trampoline? <coughs> You take off your shoes before you jump on a trampoline. <laughs> how true! How well, true. You, you don't want to damage a perfectly good trampoline, do you? <laughs> Very good indeed. <laughs> this is from Mrs. Jemima Hughes of Coronation Avenue. Uh, and yeah. A joke is, if you see, if you see a drowning downer, what do you throw him? Uh huh. So, uh, a brick, an anvil. Well, you can't very well throw an anvil, can you? What about a grenade? No. Who has <laughs> grenades these days? Answer: Another downer. <laughs> well then. I told you it was good. <laughs> That's wonderful. It's very good. How do you save a drowning downer? <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> And here's another one. Um, how do you save a drowning diner? Answer, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> All right, that one made me laugh. <laughs> Lovely jokes. Lovely All jokes. right, I'm not going to laugh. No, do not laugh. And here's one from, not that one, no, this one here. It's from Clive Pritchard that. of Slavebrook Road. <laughs> Mr. Pritchard. <laughs> Question. Ah, uh, fuck it. Answer. Eventually they'll both stop whining. <laughs> oh, is that connection? You must say your joy immediately. How do you save a drowning downer? Who cares? So many of them out here. Bloody hell. Oh, bloody hell. All right. Righto. It looks like the curfew, but nobody actually betting a shit to Betty and I. Would you look at that? Supposed to be a footlocker somewhere around here. I suppose it is. Uh, oh my god. Mission dangerous. I must take my domestic rifle. Jeez, oh shit. There you go, now I'm gonna take the rifle. And again, I mean, it's a perfectly good rifle, well, too. Why would it someone actually even bother? I don't know. Ah, the rat. The thanks of a grateful nation. Bleach. Even bricks. Oh, if you're not a bloody mule, pick what you can carry easily. Eh, uh, you know what? Fuck the rifle. I'll take something else. Take a pipe. I said I'll take a pipe. There we go. A lot of good stuff. Last oh, footlocker. Potet. This house has an attic. But how'd you get into it? An attic. Attic. Mm. 
Mmm, yummy mushroom. Something did happen. Uh, oh! Alright. Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. Right. The help. Hmm. In that case... No. Actually... There we go. These ones over here. Oh. These ones over here can go to hell. Because I got myself some better ones, yeah? Alright. Maybe I should just throw a rock or a bottle at it and blow it up safely. You think? Yeah, that worked. Surprisingly, get any attention from anyone outside. Here's your radio talk. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Bigger banger. Wow. Then I can join the army. As an officer, unless. Uh. Hello? Anyone out there? This is Central. What's your report? Over. Uh. Who is this? This is Central. Who's this? Are you in the resistance? N no, no. Well. Uh. I suppose I, I sort of am. A bit. Yeah, yes, I'm definitely with the resistance. Are you the new recruit? Y yeah, yeah, I, uh, uh, not that long ago. Feels like a while though. Uh, they call me Striker. I like that name. Are you ready for a mission? Where are you? We need you to rescue Peachy Carnahan. He was captured trying to infiltrate the secret lair of the evil Dr. Belloc. Oh my god. Oh god, it's that loony in the treehouse. I'm talking to Johnny Bolton, aren't I? Executive? The lad with all the dolls? If you're not in the resistance, get, get off this channel! <laughs> so much for the resistance. Piece of fucking shit. Oh. Essentially, I'm mean, just tossing away these things, you know. But holy shit.
Hold on. Quest item. Makes decent people upset. Doesn't, doesn't bother Rotten Wastrel though. And you can see why. And yeah. I've now realized that. I can't have. Gotta go back inside the bunker before the end and before I'm spotted by the enemies. Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. Yeah, we have five pieces of those now. There you go. Sleep. The poor man's dinner. Nice breakfast, and then... A properly good... Yeah, I suppose. Oh. Alright. Someone more vigorous. Was a doctor? Well, was. Alrighty. Did you uh, go fuck yourself? Watch where you're going, will you? <laughs> Can't we work something out? No. Sorry to bother. <sighs> well. Uh, maybe that's what it was. Well, well. <laughs> one less time. Time to stop after the first point. That's the one. Right. 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 That son of a bitch. Right. 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 Don't want to run away, and ain't it? Don't want to run away. Right. Right. That's the one that did it. You won't get away. Yes, yeah, it may be. Yes, yeah, that it shall be. Oh my God. Principal behind me. They're really dumb just to go over at one little. Okay, they really, they really are that dumb, aren't they? All right, good. Lovely day for it. Here we go. I like green stuff flying down. That's a Moshe violation right there, I'd say. Sorry, sir. There has been a slight hiccup in the disposition of the lab. And it is currently in isolation. No one in, no one out. Please come back later. Uh, but, but, uh, uh, I'm a reporter. I'm supposed to interview Dr. Verloc. Oh, I hope he hasn't forgotten. Oh, a journalist, eh? 
Have you got your press pass? Well, I uh, left it at the office. Bullshit. Well then, you'd best go back and get it, haven't you? Maybe I can go talk to Mrs. Oliphant at the Oak Corral. See if she's got a spare press pass. Bullshit. Also, all right. Night Stalker, Eat the Ground, Bloody Hell, Chain Sweep, Eh, Bloody Hell. <laughs> Olsen's house. Alrighty then. Fuck with these things over here. But right nah. Lovely day for it. Right, eh? Mm. Dead giveaway. I mean, dead end. I can't see you. Why can't I fix this? This is beyond the mirror. I mean, yeah, I mean, look at look. Whatever. Oh. Not letting me use it. Strange. You take your joy in me. Thought you were in me. That's coming from Gemma's house. That's a bit awkward. Uh, just stay to read the meter. I don't think so, you little shit. Sorry. I guess someone noticed she's not been around and decided to rob the place. Oh, 
then a boiler suit, some runny boots. And it always hadn't always been so darn easy, huh? Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. Hmm. Yerky. Swear by all that is holy, if I find one toy train in your swag bag, I'm gonna knock your last tooth down your throat! Gordo, turn that fucking thing off and come back down here right now! If the alarm's upstairs, I'm gonna have to get past Mr. Shelter here. Ow! What on earth? Who the fuck are you? I live here. Love what you've done with the place. Right now, they have to run after him, and I can't. And I fucking can't. Oh. I can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. He really fucked up the that thing, haven't he? Alright. A little bit of spanker. My ears should recover in a few days. Should. Should. Hmm. No, I will not keep my voice down. I am a law-abiding citizen. I am not upset. I'm happy as a clam. You have no right to touch me. I'm a reporter. You have no right to touch me. You know perfectly well I've taken my joy. You can't take me away. I'm not sick or unhappy. Help! Police! Help! Someone stop them! Where are they taking her? Why did they take her? She sounds quite sane. Did she know too much? About what? Gemma, I would never have pictured it. I'm not sure I actually want to, come to think of it. Good Lord. These things, I swear. Oh, right. Got three pipes. Oh, 
Come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. Happiness is a choice. Whatever. Should we just take everything? I don't think Dr. V would like that. The constabulary might notice. I don't see anything talking about Dr. V here. Where's her study? I thought vampires had to be invited in. Down up! Vampire has to be in. That ought to buy me some time. Open up and down! Come out! We're friends of Gemma! Look at that. You've been a busy girl, haven't you, Gemma? She needs our help. I think I've found everything. Doesn't look like she found all the answers yet. Electrocutions. If I read it top to bottom, then right to left. If I finished Gemma's investigations, Mrs. Oliphant would have to give me back my old job. And then I'd have a press pass. Nope, I don't think so. Go see what's going on in this motoring regulation unit. Maybe the answer's there. Downer. Uh. Downer. controls are not all that responsive, to be honest. enough. I think the body of electric... Someone hasn't been... Uh, creepy bastards. <laughs> uh, Where did they go used to run the hundred bases? Creepy bastards think like they, uh, they know who take the door or what not, you know? a municipal work site and you're not a municipal worker are you huh? so clear off whatever whatever central sent me to help out oh and i suppose you learned all about municipal infrastructure back at central i like to think i can figure a few things out Oh, you can figure things out. Who needs 20 years of experience when the new lads can just suss it out with their eyes? Hey, let's all learn from the new lad! Well, this seems fairly obvious. Don't you just turn that?
don't! Never heard it do that before. Oh dear. I, uh, there's a tool I need. I'll, I'll just go get it. What did he do to it? Has anybody got a pipe wrench? <laughs> Ow. I should really have paid more attention when Dad was banging on the plumbing. I hope they're not dead. They're unconscious, but I can change that. There we go. Now nothing to even worry about. See? How oh, did I ever? I knew it was right. Oh, that's right. Why am I even bothering with this? I'll drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow going. Wait, and then thankfully, but this does. Mm. Power's out on the elevator. I need to find a way to turn the juice back on. Right? Permanent solution to a joy problem. Who? That'll make things a bit better. Why wouldn't they, hmm? Well, good enough. Right out there now. How do I cross that platform without getting electrocuted? Now make sure there isn't a short circuit of <laughs> fucking apprentices. They never fucking listen. <laughs> Especially me of the after joy. My man, as he picked up his hammer and saw. Joy. She was really onto something, wasn't she? <laughs> there. There we go. Muffins are intersected three without a gas. He accidentally poisoned the muffins. 
Even on joy, people aren't that stupid. Unless there's something wrong with the joy. If I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Can I, can I have? I got about 50. Oh wow. Nearly 60. Well then, quite a lot. Dreadful, I'd say. There we go. That's one part of the problem done. Just like you know, take care, take care of things, you know, much quicker. Especially, I hate it when things like this get even up. Oh, right. It's podcast. All right, thanks for that, Jolty. I think you should need to take off the gas mask. Oh, let's start coughing. What the hell oh, is that? I wanted thing? to drive one of those things. They sort of look like tea kettles, don't they? How have I not noticed that? This face really is falling apart, isn't it? Is it not? Yes, it is. Did. Two, three, and you. Okay, that's not what I was aiming for. Mm -hmm. uh, the joy's going bad. That'll drive the entire town crazy. And then, and then. All the bad things that would happen. I have a feeling there's not supposed to be quite so many red lights on this board. 
Bash on St. George. Oh. Oh. That's right, the zombies. From the adjustments. They're adjusting the formula. New materials. Well, that sounds encouraging. Now, when people sound encouraging in Wellington Wells, something terrible is usually happening. Rather unhealthy in here. Maybe I'll be safer in the jubilator. Oh, right. Happened like some sort of quick time event or what? <laughs> there. This is the slowest roller coaster I've ever been on. La 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 la. Make way! Make way for Captain Toad of Total! <laughs> oh, I don't think this music is a little. God damn it, give me a moment. <sighs> it's YouTube, it's a problem. Not there we go. What did he got? Probably nothing. I wonder what this does. It's closed. Shit. How do I open it? Right when the fun thing fun Right when the fun is about to happen. I'll turn the the music volume back up. Sorry, can't stay. Oh. Alright. I oh, guess I didn't even need to. I guess I didn't even need to activate the the speed thing. I thought you know that the music is gonna go la 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 la. A damn time, but no. Oh, so wrong there's an exit was. door here, I think, but I'm gonna have to turn on some power switches. You're not bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. Hmm. Five, huh? Suppose. So you got four, though. But now that you've got any four. Or whatever. Do I want to save the game? Is because it went down not. Is that how the puppies get around? I wonder if they ever get stuck. That could get awkward. You think? There you go. Mmm, fresh meat. Yes. But again, this place really is falling apart. Joking. Peter, there you are. Why don't you come down and we'll have a chat about loyalty? No, oh, don't be a big girl blouse, laddie. I'm just having fun with you, aren't I? Come on down and let's have a laugh. Yeah, 
I wish. <coughs> oh, I'd love to stay here, but... Uh, it's toxic. Oh, fuck, I just want to... Oh, God. Where's the door? For heaven's sake, doesn't anything work around here? Not if anything's actually uh, all that... Body up some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. She believes got some weaknesses, what? Hold on. Robust buggers, turns out. A big electric shock. Bashing the rear access panel. Check the evader. That'd be too come to think about it. Yeah, thanks. Really appreciate that. Damn it, where did I get rid of some of these things? Hmm. No, but if not these one, then which one it is? Maybe of all these things over here that I... Yeah, I only need one anyways. What good did I ever do? I have no darn clue. Doesn't anything work around here? Maybe I have enough. Have enough of it. I don't know. Now the problem is just another bulb. Maybe. Forget. For heaven's sake, doesn't anything work around here? Ah, here we go. Here we go. So why do I turn all those for? I know the dark clue. Okay, that's one. Two more, I think. It's a bug on a drug. Yeah, 
some of this then. I should have done something about this. Oh, so that's what it does. But I'm um, you know, gas mask, so yeah. Right, right, right. I never switches to turn on this bloody door. I sort of think this place is about to explode. Maybe. You asshole. Urgent joy. There we go. Ouch. You know what? Fuck you. Look at that, not even that works. I never switches to turn on this bloody door. There's the power room. Hold on. How am I supposed to get across? Percy, what are you doing? I'm swimming! Oh, good Christ, where are your clothes? Percy, where are your clothes? What? Scripting error or what? Diffuse airborne joy. You order the room. Oh. I'm going to tell you to do something. If I don't say Simon says. If I do say Simon says. Yes, you do. Alright. Is everybody ready? Are you ready? Who you are? Yes, that's the one in well spirit. Everybody give the hand. Good. There's nothing happening. They need a what? Are you son of a... There we go. Hold on. Just in case, I mean, just in case. ones over here. Okay, one, two, 
two. No less than that and over here. Up there. Quick ones, at least. Now, what the hell? You're gonna run me down with that thing! Not that you run fast enough, you rotten fool! Let's have a conversation. I'm sorry, no. Banger then. We're supposed to have to do nothing. <sighs> the cockpit. I should go. Alright. A shock grenade. I wonder if that's where I need to kill this berserk tea kettle. Shepherd, there we go. Look, I'm, I'm doing a newspaper story uh, about how well you're all holding up down here. I think I've read that article a few times. How well are you holding up down here? On good days, we get more things working than break down. And on bad days? Like today, look, there's a big electronic board down there. Tells us what's broken. Ironically, that works perfect. Here's a diagram. Oh, look, it's time for my tea break. Ta-ra! This isn't a diagram, it's a letter. A permanent solution. Again? What kind of permanent solution is he thinking of? Whatever it is, I bet that's what got Gemma taken away by the doctors. Oh, there we go. There you have it. There you have it. Huh. Hey, thanks. Yes, 
Master Works bench. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Tranquilated that. Rotten apple. I have an idea what it looks like. <sighs> right. 6 p.m. Good enough. For now, that is. Shit. Bloody hell. Oh, bloody hell. Lovely day for it. Hmm. Quite a bit far away. <laughs> hmm. To find myself at least those. I don't know. I mean, I didn't used to run a whole lot more. I didn't think I used to run a hundred meters. Oh, shush, yeah. I hope I'm not actually coming down with something. That'd be rich. So, this, you know, bitter as hell tea that makes you sick is. We're willing for both uh, food and drink, yes. Alright, at least those are not doctors. What the bubbies? Lovely weather! Alright. What do I gotta lose him? I think I might be overdosing. <laughs> right, now it's like getting a new job while looking like a crackhead. Alright, we'll see about that, you fraud. I have a sneaking suspicion that they want some coffee. Hmm, why wouldn't they? Terribly busy. What is it? Gemma's been taken away. I saw two doctors shove her into a pool. Oh my goodness. Why? She was digging into the tunnels. That didn't come out right. I, I, I followed up. The whole underground is sort of falling apart. Oh my. That's why you sent her, wasn't it? Not to write about the tunnel rats. 
I certainly couldn't print a story like that. Could I? The joy's gone bad, and Dr. Verloc knows. But he's telling them not to worry. He's got some sort of permanent solution. That doesn't sound ominous at all. Well, that's sort of exactly what I thought. If I had a press pass, I could get into Hayworth Labs. And my old adulator, if you still got it. After what happened to Gemma? Dr. Verloc, he's sort of his own law there. I have some personal business there. If I'm not here when you get back, if you found something out, see if you can't publish it. Those numpties out there know how to put the ink on the page, but the only articles they ever read are their own. You're getting out? How? Oh, I wouldn't even know how to get out. You never know when I might stop printing lies. And they won't like that. Great. I've got all my press stuff back. That ought to be handy. You can shut up all sorts of places regular people shouldn't go. Mm -hmm. Old job. <laughs> Old job. Lovely day for it. I got a new compliment machine. It's so clever. Good. What have we come to? Actually, yeah, might as well. Uh, you mentioned it. Clarissa Luckinbill? I got a funny name. There. Now, no one suspects a single thing. Wait, what? Huh, interesting. I'll take three. Why the hell not? I don't have the save button while I still can. Now, out of more curiosity, what the hell is this? Not totally friendly. However, we really like to take the bar. Lovely day for it. Lovely day for it. the wrong way. So what? And the best part is, I mean, there's a hatch, you know. Here and where he needs me to go. You still get your hands on a potato. Potato flour is another excellent extender for your flour supplies. Very important. You must slice it. We'll laugh about this later. I love how the other guys they don't they just don't give a shite. Oh yeah. No, start to let's say get into where I need to go. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Alright. I can get I say. Somewhere. Oh, full of boiling oil. 
Maybe I should sit down for a bit. Oh, here we go. Hope nobody noticed. Way better than before, I tell you that. Had a bit of a leak though. He'll see the game again. Listen to me. This isn't my gardening show, is it? Let's light into the road. Alright, maybe because of some of these things, I guess. Oh, whatever. What? Have a spare one around when I really need it. Ah, here we go. Nice stock of tea, am I right? Alright, what else am I missing? There we go. Yeah, I could have. There we go. Yeah, I suppose. Not really gonna have to not really have much to do with those one day. Eh. Yeah. Oh, I suppose. Should probably get rid of the rotten one, I think. Try not to dream about trains. Well, it's actually he's trying to save me a bit of time, you know, so he can do a little bit of a shitty stuff around, but eh, a little late for that. <laughs> now to where am I looking for? Here we go. Good morning, dear friends. Good morning to Oh, 
Alright. Shitty throw, I'd say. I'm getting old. Well, shit, you are. Oh, shit. All right, right as rain, right as rain. You can take your joy immediately. Otherwise, we will kill you. Kill you and kill you. Suppose I could. Oh, whatever. Uh, only one fifth down. The celebrity caller will be uh, Marjorie Cloud. You might want to see a doctor. One more done Here's it. Sleep a bit for the next minute. Right. Oh, I see you. You're coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't keep doing this. There's the one that did it. Oh, oh, boy. That crazy. Right. That cat oh, is you. done fooling around. Oh, with the, the one with the blood on We're getting something, aren't we? A nice you want some meal? I said a nice eating meal. Right I've had it right. I'm done fooling around. I'm putting a stop to this. I see so forth. One down. I want that tail. Oh, no. Do we really have to do this? Hmm. Hmm. Whatever. The lads was on lockdown. They don't listen anymore. Well, you certainly laid out a convincing argument. Are you saying I hit him too hard? I don't know. Is he breathing? Well, he made a sort of sigh. And then some gurgling noises? He came right at me. Just mm. make sure you leave that electro baton in. In case he turns out to be important. I've learned so much from you <laughs> over the years. Where do you think you're going then? We're not open to the general public. Bugger all! I'm interviewing Dr. Bullock. Ah, you're a member of the Fourth Estate. You've come at an awkward time, you see, as we're just in the middle of... Uh... Well, there's been a bit of excitement in the lab. Let's come back tomorrow. You're not saying something's gone wrong? No, of course not. Everything's peachy. Look, all right, you take your press pass up to Helen in public relations. Just uh, follow the sort of brown coloured line. I must ask you not to stray from the path because there's all sorts of delicate machinery and chemicals and whatnot, and we don't want you hurting yourself, do we? What sort of crisis makes them lock down the entire factory? Your former, your all your former neighbors, you know. True. True. I'm not sure the workers here will have the same respect for a press boss as the Bobbies did. 
You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Whatever. Hmm. The important stuff I say. Whatever. Thank you very much. Product. Now, I'll just simply... Purity is our highest goal at Hayworth Labs. The decontamination procedure allows us to maintain the highest standard of purity. Oh, I'm so glad they're concerned about purity. You have been decontaminated. Please proceed into the lab. Not. Turn down the heat on the ruminating reaction until you've noted the temperature curve. I need to determine the explosive threshold temperature. Never mind. <clears throat> Just, Just drop the temperature and pop it in the pneumatic. <laughs> oh, I, I won't sample with any residue on the explosive debris. Alright then. Much better. Live Boof Hotel. If I don't look like a sturdy man, I'm going to run around. Oh, no, he did. Okay. Thank you for the joy pill. I really appreciate it, you know. You know what? No. Maybe this then. Maybe that did got him. Oh dear. Maybe clean it? I don't know. I'm thinking. What can I do right up now? Yeah, it's not gonna let me back out, I'll tell you, I know. Fire, fire, I am on fire. Oh my god. I am burning. Oh, and you? Okay. See the violence inherent in the system. Now doing down. It's not personal. Put tools away from you. The number one priority. 
work is sent to Nursery. I wonder which one of these guys was the steam. Do they both? I feel so chivalrous turning off that dangerous steam. If that is indeed what I did. Oh. One problem for another. I love the extra zap. Always makes me feel dandy. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, look at that. Didn't even need that one. Sneak past these gents without a fuss. You think? Dr. Burl, I would like all personnel to know that he must not be disturbed for the next hour at least. Please hold all inquiries until then, or resolve the situation yourself. Would we better just go back to do your job, eh? Yourself, then. What's that? <laughs> Hold on. Mm -hmm. A bit nostalgic, I'd say. Agree to disagree. Bit of a joy withdrawal sooner or later. Oh my god, I feel so terrible. I must take my joy. Ugh. Mm, not good enough. No, I might take another one. Uh. Yes. Quite a, bit of, quite a bit of a nightmare by now. How do I open these shutters? There's probably a big red button somewhere, isn't there? Why well, wouldn't there be, hmm? This is the latest test formula. I think I'll just take this with me. Evidence or something. Permanent solution. Drive the subject insane. Oh lord. A big red button. I wonder what it opens. <laughs> I feel rather brilliant right now.
might keep these ones for something. I don't know. Oh yeah, of course. Strawberry joy. Sounds so yummy. Funny. Suddenly I remember that time I threatened to thrash Timmy Hargreaves because he said rotten things about Sally. And it turned out he had an older brother who'd been in the army. And he was waiting for me on my doorstep when I came home from school. And he gave me such a thrashing. Why would I remember that right now? Because so. Christ, Sally was in on the scheme. No, wait. She's being very nice about it, but she's not at all on board, is she? Hmm. The salamander seems to think Veloc's solution is a tad rash. Well, it's alarming given what she considers reasonably cautious. Antiseptic. Pure water. Oh, if only. The winning argument. Eh, wait. Eh, never mind. Only oh, dead already. Dr. Verloc is thinking very hard, sir. No visitors. The brominating reaction has caught fire. Sir, sorry to bother you, sir, but there's a fellow here who says the reaction tank is on fire again. I said no interruptions. Some of the byproducts are poisonous. He says it's poisonous, sir. Of course there are poisonous byproducts. Tell him to do whatever they did the last time. Dr. Burlock would like you to do whatever you did the last time. No one knows that. He's an imposter. Implement security protocol 187. Oh, yes, sir. That's my favorite protocol. Fine. I'm full of the fury of the law, and I am right weary with holding back. Right, that's perfect. Yeah, the toy he has. Holy shit. Alright, at least have a gas mask. I'm in a little bit of a pain, at least. I hate using this, but I need to, even more than ever. Let's see what this bad boy can do. Not that you're mong. Whatever. Ward the you pipe! shall drink the wine of God's wrath! Poured into the cup of his anger! Ye shall not deceive me with empty words, for the wrath of God comes upon the sons of disobedience! The Lord judgeth thee, and he is angry every day! Eat this one! Now! Just lie down! I don't need an apple, but why? Gab. This one looked like was a religious man. Well, was. Save 
the game at least. Uh, at least we found one well, and see what a, what a level three enemy can do. I kind of wonder. I asked for know. a full battery of tests done on the latest Isima. Now, where is it? Why is it not in the pneumatic? Do any of you want to keep your jobs? I'll have you all replaced by Mrs. Packer's bridge club. They do a better job than you people. They have got really good for sandwich by now. Fuck you. He's only level two, sadly. Look, they've got blood on their hands. Ah, yes, I do. In your neck. Can't we work something out? No. Am I collecting joy pills? I don't mind. What am I doing? I've always liked you, actually. Shocking biology. to each other. Ah. Right then. Evil Vel Verlock. That's what the loony says. Phrenology? Is that supposed to be ironic? Ha! <laughs> I don't think it is. Sergeant! Sergeant! Did you know half your workers are unconscious? The, the, dead. the fumes issue will resolve itself. Look. I'm very busy recalculating the brominating reaction so it is non-explosive. Unless you've got a magic formula for synthesizing joy out of bleach, whiskey and saltpeter, get out! You're planning to lobotomize the people of Wellington Wells, aren't you? Lobotomize is a rather inflammatory metaphor, but yes, I have been asked to synthesize something stronger and more permanent than joy. Who are you? If you force people to have the emotions you want, then you've turned them into robots made out of meat! <laughs> And what do you think you are now? You are just the sum of the neuropeptides swirling in your bloodstream. You see, the current downer outbreak is just a mass chemical imbalance. But I believe <laughs> I can adjust the internal hormonal settings so that people stay happy no matter what. You can't do that. They told the Wright brothers they couldn't fly. But they did. You can't do that. Oh my lord. You're that downer they've been warning us about. I'm actually just here for a bottle of cod liver oil. What makes you think I'll give it to you? This bottle of your new formula. If I smash it and you breathe the fumes, will it make you happy forever and always? You mustn't. It makes the patient insane. Ha! Now you can't move until I take my hand off this button. Idiot. Oh, shit. Bloody cod liver oil, Sally wanted. And this is the, the cleanest he... office I've ever seen. Where does he hide his junk? I wonder if he has a secret lair. Well, it's just the sort who would. Hello. I'm in a haunted house movie. Interesting. I just got the bloody gas mask. Listen, 
Sally Boyle is going to come live with us for a bit. Sally Boyle? Why? Because her mum poisoned the whole bloody rest of her family, Arthur. And because we've got a spare bed in the attic now till Percy comes back from Germany. She's your age, you know. She's an idiot. Well then, you two should get along beautifully. Huh. But how could he zap me without even... Dr. Verloc seems to be quite the collector. Where's the fucking cod liver royal? He's an idiot, I'll tell you that. Complete buffoon. A coyone. A cornuto. What? The King of X! The King of X! The King of X! Don't laugh, Arthur. Don't laugh. <laughs> Cheery. I'm breaking this one or whatever. And thank you, Sally, for another wonderful adventure. now uh, none of these on the convict now Pills go out. What's going on this conveyor belt? <laughs> Possibly me. How ironic, I'd say. What the? All right. Door jammed. How many pills here? Oh, right. <gasps> oh, that smells awful. Smells awful. Do I need to smell it? No, I don't. Is this why they flush the chemicals? Nick, Nick, hello, you're my hero. Da, 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 da. Uh, drain? To where? The river? Might be a way out. I think I'm on pausing in the river. Not that anything's alive in it now. Right then. You would be decaying by now. Ah, uh, a hatch. Lovely. I've never seen so many hatches in my entire life. They fall in, or were they pushed, or were they flushed? Oh, you're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. Here's these things, I know.
right then? No one saw me? Good. And now to make the delivery of cod oil. Hold on a sec. And the fun thing is, I mean, I got everything over here that to eat, but not to drink. Oh, I mean, I guess I do actually. I have a bit of a small cost, I'd say. Well, there we go. Not spike with joy. I can't see you. Writer's right, writer's right. Right about sooner or later. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. If only you know the stamina would recover a whole lot more faster, right? Oh. How would I use this? There we go. Even more vigor than before. Oh, hello. No doctors over here? Eh, leave him be. Just looking where he is, the engine's drawing a lot of attention. She better have my bloody letter of transit. So? Sally? Salamander? If she's not here, I swear to God I'll kill her. Hi. Hmm. I got it. Your precious cod liver oil. Oh, you're a lifesaver. It's a bloody souvenir. God, it's awful. Hmm. Have you got my letter of transit then? Arthur, we're practically the only two people in this entire city not stoned out of our minds on joy. How are you holding up? What do you care? How are you going to get out? Why won't you just give me the fucking letter of transit? Oh, it's always what you want. Always what you need. Every little Sally whim. Bloody cod liver oil. Do you really th think I'm that awful? What, just because you fucked my dad while you were living in our house? In my mum's bed? Oh. <sighs> I'm sorry. <sighs> Look, I don't hate you. In the strangest way, you're completely innocent. You're practically the only one I know who is. It's on the dresser there. Are you going to be okay? Give her a hug, you I dope. I can take you with me. Really? We have to go now. The joy's gone bad. It's going crazy out there. I can't go right now. Why? Oh, God. No. It's not simple. It never is. We'll have to wait till dawn. No, that, that, that's crazy. I, I can't. Oh, you shouldn't have asked for that ridiculous cod liver oil. Look, there's something I haven't been entirely straight with you about. Oh. Don't say it. It's just self-preservation, Sally. No hard feelings. Do you think she really meant it? The kiss and all? What if I went back and said, yes, yes, I'll take you and... They lived happily ever after. Oh, a girl like that shipwrecks and the next day she's drinking margaritas under palm trees and you'll suffer for shocks. That is it. Never again. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh, whatever. You know, he should have slept with her. Because no. Because no. Answer your letters and questions about our life in Wellington Wells. And today's best letter Hold from on. Charles Hawtrey. Wait till dawn. Let's see, you know, there's actually more than this here. Nine. Jesus Christ. All right. This is. Mm. Doctor Hayworth. All right. Charles Hawtrey or St. James Parade. Fuck it. You are not authorized. Please clear the area immediately. Hmm. So, no. Nothing in there. I can't keep doing this. Lovely idea. Of course he didn't notice that now, did he? Lovely day for it. May I see your letter of transit, please? Welcome to the parade, sir. And may I say you've arrived not a moment too soon. What do you mean, Constable? A word to the efficient is sufficient, sir. If you catch my drift. I would not count on this bridge remaining operational in the near future. Nudge, nudge, smirk, smirk. Oh. Say no more, say no more. We like to work, are we? Somewhat. Trains. Here we go. I don't like trains, Arthur. Are you joking? You love trains. Do you remember when we went to Plymouth on that train? You didn't want to get off. That was in 1941. Yeah, it must have been. I... I... I, I don't want you to go to Germany. You think I want to go? I don't know where we're going, I don't know what they're gonna do with us there, and who knows if we're ever really coming back. But I don't have much of a bloody choice, do I? You would talk to me. When you're gone. Dad talks to you. Well, no, I suppose he doesn't really. But he does love you. I believe you, Arthur. He's just really rubbish at showing it. Hmm. Fair enough. Ah, oh, the parade. Just like I pictured it. Strange to be back here. How long ago was it I used to just trundle off to work every day, right around here? Now I just need to get into the broadcast tower so I can get into Appleholm Station and find the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. Never really is that easy, eh? Never really is. Find the last hatch. Last hole I can burrow myself into. The Fashion Institute. I bought some trousers there. Bloody expensive too. If I remember correctly, they've got a hatch in their basement. Good thing Sally taught me to be nosy. Who knows when I might need to get to a bed? I should see if I can get down there. And if there even be a curfew and all that fun stuff, yes. I cannot snatch that damn thing off it. I want you to plop on the ground, hmm? Want your mong? You freaking animal! I want you to get in the game with some some shelter. How 
dare he cancel on me? I don't care if he's double booked. He was nothing before I taught him how to walk. Uh, I know. I, I know how to model. Sorry, love. Tits ruin the drape. Buy me a new male model. Too sweet. Is he gay? Why? That was fast. Hmm. Right height. Right build. Bit tan for my taste. You're new, aren't you? Never mind. You're Quentin Scent. You're probably not hopeless. I just hope to God you can strut. Go downstairs and ask Nigel what to do. I'm gonna have to do this stupid fashion show to get it, aren't I? And maybe the models can tell me how not to make a complete fool of myself up there. Well, looks like someone have been taking your joy, haven't they? Jolly good fun! I can't wait to see how they fixed up Lud's home. <laughs> <laughs> That's adorable, you know. I'm in a pint, I'd say. What? Polarity device. Come on, be fabulous. Rather need you to stop buggering yourself and open the fucking door. Um, Fuck! My pants ripped. Davy will kill me. You wouldn't have a sewing kit. <sighs> Fabulous shreds. Is he fucking blind? Is that right over here? Would you like this? Thanks, Azil. Now the whole crowd won't have to see my knickers. <laughs> I'm sort of new. Got any advice? Try fierce, I'm watching you move. Uh, yes. Don't you look smart? You look like a ghost. You are the one, aren't you? I'm a bit fucked up, but Candyman said it was a semi special, but. but he lied. I'd kill several innocent people for a flash. Do you know any innocent people? I don't either. So they're pretty high, aren't they? Right. Like, he knows what you've been doing. He knows very well. Me, I'm just looting damn place. You're a lifesaver. Uh, any advice for the catwalk? Do a cheeky little bang bang gesture. They love that. Cheerio! Mind me while I loot the entire place. You seem not entirely delighted. Stage fright. The last time I tripped on the catwalk, Davy locked me in a fucking closet for three days. I could use a shot of whiskey, but all we have in this wretched place are drugs. This will help. Thank God. Can you believe he made me tape up my tits? Like that girl who played Dorothy in that old movie about the shoes. Oh. oh that helps. I'll let you in on a little modeling secret. I toss the crowd a bouquet. They love that. All those lads want to be bribed, but it's not gonna happen, is it? Mm -hmm. Boom, there we go. 
Who's running? The crowd's restless, dearie. Go out there and fucking wow them. Just strut to the spots marked with X and show yourself off. And quickly! We'll get going then. You are capable of walking ten feet, aren't you? Oh, and whatever you do, don't fuck up. Okay, and on your mark, and work it. Be fierce, Arthur. Be fierce. Yeah. How about the bang bang? Pew! Oh, no, my dad's not here to see this. I'm fierce. I'm the fiercest. How about a bouquet? How does it feel to be one of the beautiful people? The task already. Move on from Puce. Hopeless. You're utterly sung charisma. I'm not surprised you're homeless. Say, Mr. Hackney, it's a bit late and I sort of live on the other side of town. Would it be too much trouble? I suppose you did do me a favour. Here, get some beauty sleep. Not that it'll help. Sometimes we just want to crush his head in. Don't mind me, just having a bit of a sit down. How much of a mess can this guy have over here? Holy hell. Right. Anyone over here? One tough camera. Do it Look, it's finish. not me, it's me. We all appreciate what you do. Of course.
Hmm. You're a credit to us all. Compliment, huh? Hmm. Robot here like he is, eh? Of course. Why would he never be? Save a bit for the next one. Thought you were invisible, did you? Oh. Uh, the chief asked me to borrow the scissors. Have you got them stashed away somewhere? What? They seem to be a lot more serious about the plague here. It must be spreading fast. Not a pleasant thought. I'm not a Bobby, if that's how well they're taking care of Bobby Poppers these days. Do you have those numbers for George yet? Did you hear? Bulky Jack got another one. Last night. Best stay in. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Why are we doing this to each other? Extremely glad I'm not a Bobby. Indeed, right? There's the guilty bugger. Right there. <laughs> right, that would have left the <laughs> Look, I don't even want to be here. Oh, God damn it. Here we go. Much better. as long as these poppers are popping out constables. Right! I've had it with you! Hmm? That it hurt something. Can't we just agree to disagree? Lovely. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more.
Whatever. But still. Oh, but still. This piece of shit. It's not as good. It is fucked. I want to use this. I'll find a boss who have done this. But this thing actually worked out well, but no, it didn't. Stunning! Lovely day for it. Seems to be out in uh walks. I better find a way to turn these off if I want to get through that gate uncooked. Whatever works best, yes. Missing. Out of order. That popper looks like it's rather well maintained. I wonder if I can change it. What am I doing? Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. Hmm. Mm, I reckon this stuff. Brilliant. My God, thief! Oh dear, I don't think that's working anymore. Can't we work something out? No? Hey, Brawly. Hmm. something away before something starts chasing you. Oh. Well. Oh dear, that's not working anymore either. Things have come to a pass indeed. Oh yes, they sure have. Oh come on you pack rat, you can't take all this with you. Well yeah. These well, things aren't really all that interesting to carry around I'd say.
There. All oh, that bother. And I don't even have plague. I don't see why you can't unquarantine the pie shop. Cook is beside herself. My dear lady, if we lift the quarantine gate on the pie shop for you, we'd have to lift every quarantine gate for anybody. No, you wouldn't. I'm not anybody, am I? Yes, you are. Perish the thought, madam. You can just do it for me. I'm afraid we actually can't. Our quarantine control grid needs a, a framistat. We've ordered a new one from the Department of Scientific Research. I'm throwing a dinner on Friday. I expect you to get your family whatever and unquarantine the pie shop, or I shall have to explain to the Minister of Health why we have no pie. Get a pie. Marvellous. I'm so looking forward to the Battle of Flowers, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. I suppose. Enjoy. Uh. Hmm. You will never guess who I call sneaking out of the executive washroom. Right, oh. How pointless. I, I didn't think I used to run a hundred bases. And why do you keep sinking to the ground? I would never know. I'm getting old. No, you're not. Quit bullshitting yourself. Down here. That's the funny part. But where do I have to go? Oh. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry I couldn't be at the meeting. Did I miss anything critical? You know, I think we wear the same size. You know, I'm starting to think I shouldn't brush your skull in. Drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's going to be tediously slow going. Mmm, so close. At least for now. Oh, whatever. At least this one here does work like a charm, so then at least there's that. I'm the new guy. Any idea where my desk is? Watch out for scurvy, Uncle Jack says. Watch out for scurvy, Uncle Jack says. What difference would that ever make, huh? What difference would that ever We'll laugh about this later. Oh, come on, you pack rat. You can't take all this with you. Hmm. Maybe there'll be some other junk over here that I wouldn't be needing. Like these things. Huh. They don't have any weight on them. Alright. These are quest items and can't be dropped, I know. 
Oh, of course. The, the perpetrator of the crime. Horson. For some better stuff, there's always a more, always more needed to it, isn't it? Hmm. All right. Interesting. If we can just reduce the budget a tad more, I think we can really make an impact. You're looking nice and trim. You have a bad idea. I can't allow that. Put that down! <laughs> you must perish. What have we come to? I actually think you owe me a bit of money. Don't worry, he died of Ligma. Door check. Nice boots check. Here's something new. Should look around more often. Have you ever wondered what life will be like 20 years into the future? Tell me. That would be the year 1984. Yes, it sounds like a very long way away, doesn't oh. it? Oh. But 1984 may be closer than you think. Oh. At the Wellington World's House of the Future, you can imagine yourself in 1984 when machines will clean your house like uh, now. <laughs> That'll make your life happy, won't it? And will also have pills that replace food that you'll never have to eat again. Mmm, beef Wellington. Delicious. Now, the inventors at the Department of Scientific and Industrial Research have all sorts of amazing things in store. We'll have typewriters that type the words for you as you say them. And imagine being able to listen to your own music anywhere you go. How ironic. In phone booths. Yes, there'll be a built-in record player. Just bring your favorite records along when you go for a spin in your flying car. And of course, we'll always have our joy. We couldn't do without that, could we? It won't change a bit. It's perfect just the way it is. <sighs> Okay. Well, it's your own pepper jack. Oh, that's interesting. Ashen in the future. A bunch of meth heads in space just looking to kill you. 1984. Yeah, looks like the Orwells was right about about it. Prey on nylons. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Hey faggot! Hey faggot! This shit doesn't work. Yeah, fun time to have with this thing. Listen to Uncle Jack wherever you go. Oh, I can only imagine. Workers won't be on this point. Should I hit the button? Now, if I were at all to disable the quarantine gates, where would I be? Well, if it's not down here, I bet it's in that office. Harbour Eaves, there's the vulcanizer gas dot. We need to adjust the flow mechanism. It's still wasting a lot of motor lead. Die. Yes, well, it's for knocking down my blocks in kindergarten. I see someone's in the calf. If you don't have anything pressing to do, would you kindly 
bring me up some tea? Sure, I'll bring you some tea, alright. A tea with extra blood in it. If you don't mind. Would you be friend? I got some for you. Locked, of course. Can't have the staff running in and out asking questions, can we? I'm solving a very difficult equation. Leave me in peace. Apparently, yeah. Confucius was wrong. The way in is not by the door. Someone please send Hargreaves up here. I can't be down on the floor all the time chasing people. <laughs> Yes, I did it. You're next. The hell I'm bleeding. Who else are you missing? Hmm? I'm Takarai. I'm having a craving for a pie. Now get up there. The car really soft. Allow me to chain you up. Boy. That was you then, brother you. Another one down. Do we really have to do Got this? More to go. Yes, I did. And guess what? You're next. It's not personal. It's a prototype for some sort of torch you use in the kitchen. Doesn't seem to have all its bits. I wonder if I could find something around here. This seems to turn modeling crystals into gas. A lot of gas would charge up that cannon. That's I'll one. Probably need some sort of valve handle to unblock this, I think. Yes, I agree. What do you got here? This seems to be in operating condition. Don't know if you want that or not, but alright. Now we see the violence inherent in the system. Looks familiar. I'd better get back to the office. Yes, you better do. Sorts. An electrowave stimulator. What does it do? I suppose it stimulates electrowaves. That doesn't sound right. Seems to be missing a battery. These machines don't seem to be in tip top condition, do they? What was it? Get <coughs> I've always liked you, actually. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Of course. What I got here? Oh, if you're not bloody mule, pick what you can carry easily. This one seems to be in good condition though. Oh well. I would call it a bit of a blood bleeding effect, but well, looks like I'm wrong, aren't I? Good. No. 
Fine. What more does it actually want from me, eh? What do you have to do? I have to eat, huh? Ah, oh, fuck it. I could take these all the time, but I wouldn't have any worries. You know, I'm eating a lot of apples, apparently. There we go. Flash the nozzle. Whatever this is, alright. Now, how will this work here? I have no genuine idea. for knocking down my blocks in nursery. Well, you can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. I yeah, you have to agree with that. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get rid of this. I get rid of this all too, because why not? In fact... So now. We do have someone named Hargreaves. I haven't completely lost my mind, have I? Yes, you have. Yes, you have completely. He's promising. Like something's missing, isn't it? Please, the breeze. I need a bloody great blast of air. How do I keep this up a notch? Right, isn't he? <laughs> Two, actually. There we go. Can't we just agree to disagree? <laughs> Far better than I expected it would. <gasps> so, my ingenuity proved it, or what? Interesting toys, I'd say. You're not a bloody mule. Pick what you can carry easily. Eh, I don't need this actually. 
I suppose you're who I have to thank for the hole in my wall. Oh, did knock? Don't be silly. Do you know how long I've been asking them to fix the hot flash? I can't even remember. Oh, uh, the power cell was missing. Oh, for heaven's sake. They said they had to wait for a part. Look, <laughs> without help or even a manual, you fixed three machines and triggered a chain reaction. Yes. Well, sorry about that. I need a chap who can figure things out. Would you like a job? Uh, oh, uh, I'm afraid I'm sort of trying to get out of town. Why? This is the best of all possible worlds. Nothing gets done, but everyone's happy. Hmm. You seem sort of exasperated, actually. Well, don't tell anyone, all right? How are you getting past the quarantine gates without a framistat? I was hoping to get one from, uh, here. They've been pestering me for a while. Tell you what, I'll give you one, and when you're done with it, Give it to them from me. Oh, that's very kind of you. I will. Here, look yeah. around. If there's something else you can use, take it. Good show. You can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. Oh, what do I gotta lose? I knew something was up over here. And if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Mm. Looks like someone just lost their job. All right. And an electric weapon at best too. Fair enough. Or there's a room where you have some like a security room it seems. Alright. I like the gun. I just need to find myself a proper... Uh, the proper recipe for it. Mm. That one is that one thing I'm after. E five fum. Hmm. 
So I see. I suppose. Oh, does it be old man's on a rampage? Oh, and asking for a raise today. Sorry, mustache. Lovely day for it. Report. Can you believe that? All right. Oh dear. I forgot about the headmistresses. Or have we? Hmm. Drat. Oh, drat, all right. Please step away immediately. I don't see how they expect me to visit the shops on the other side with all these bankers and things. I almost feel unwanted. Mm hmm. Well, yeah, that's all the time I had for the time being. Hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I have to look forward to the next one. So I hope to see you guys next time, and until then, 